We've got 12 rounds, full body, no jumping. This is pure sweat and fat burn. You ready, champ? Let's go. All right, champ, let's do this. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram. Go ahead, like, share, subscribe, hit the bell. You know what to do. We are getting ready. This is a 12 rounder, babies. Make the cut. Workout number 10, starting off with the jab. We've got three minutes of work to do. We are going to be stacking our punches one at a time to create one long combination. Right now, we're starting with that jab, and now we're gonna go with a jab. You move and a jab again. So I want you to treat it as separate combinations. One, move, one. Stick the one, move, stick the one. There we go, move your head off the midline, move your head, move your feet. Let's add on one, 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 two. If you don't know what the numbers are, look at the bottom left corner of your screen. The one is your jab, the two is your cross. We're going jab, 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 cross. If you are an orthodox fighter as a righty, you are left, 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 right. When you are a southpaw, which means you are a lefty fighter, it is the opposite, right, 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 left. We are continuing with the one move, one move, one, two. All right, we're about to add soon. Here we go. One, one, jab, cross, jab, cross. I want you to give me a little fire, a little energy. I know we are just starting. We're one minute in already. You got this, champ. Jab, 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 cross, jab, cross. I want you to find that rhythm. I want you to find that cadence. All right, boxing is like a dance, right? Move your head, you move your feet. Always be moving, be a moving target and find the rhythm in your body. Jab, 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 cross, jab, cross. There you go, you're looking great there, champ. Come on, I want you to breathe, breathe. All right, let's add. We're gonna add a defense move. After the one, two, one, two, you slip towards the rear hand. That's it, one. One, one, two, one, two, you slip their jab. That's how this works, adding here with a counter. We're gonna add a rear uppercut now. There we go, so it's one, 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 two, one, two, slip six. Jab, 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 cross, jab, cross, slip, rear uppercut. There we go, all right, adding now. We're gonna add two slips now. After the rear uppercut, slip, rear, slip, lead. Setting ourselves up for the next punch. One, 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 two, one, two, slip, six, slip, slip. Move your head off the midline. I want you to slip and add that five, which is the lead uppercut. When you slip off the midline, when I say slip off the midline, we never want to pull back or reach back. I want you to think forward and side. Forward and side, there's a little hip hinge there to avoid and evade the punch. Good, so it's one, 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 two, one, two, slip six, slip, slip five, adding here, we are burning. Slip, slip five, slip, slip six. So always the last 30 seconds of these rounds will be some sort of burnout or drill, all right? So this is where you get to practice. This is where you get to work a little harder. You get to work up and improve on your punches and improve on your technique. Right here, you got less than 10, champ. Come on, babies, come on, huh? Huh, move off the midline, punch, move off the midline, punch in three, in two, and in one. Guess what, now we're going into our full body movement. Good morning, check it out, we're gonna sit into one side. Sit, transfer the weight, get back up. Good morning. Shifting lateral lunge. So we wanna stay low as we weight distribute from one side to the other. So we sit into one side, we shift, we get back up. We hip hinge, we good morning. Flat back, make sure you squeeze at those shoulder blades. Good, this is 20 seconds left, full 45 seconds of full body work here where we do not jump. But I promise you, you will work hard and you will feel every muscle in your body working. Good, nice job. Less than 10, hip hinge, you could do this. Hip hinge, stand tall, sit into one side, shift the weight to the other side, stand tall, three, two, one. Nice, 15 seconds to rest. Champ, let me know how you are feeling. Round one is done. Today is a long one, babies. Today is a long one. 12 rounds in total. So we are going to work hard today, but we are in workout 10 of Make the Cut. So round number two is starting off with a double jab cross. One, one, two. Left, left, right as a southpaw. It is right, right, left. I want you to think of rotation. Always be rotating, especially on that cross. Boom, boom, rotate. Lead with that lead shoulder, don't square up. And then you find your punches coming down the pipeline. When I say that, it's right down the middle, upstairs to somebody's face, ba ba bang. And again, your rhythm is bang, bang, bang. Ish, ish, ish. Yep, don't be afraid to breathe. Don't be afraid to be audible with your movement and your breath, okay? All right, adding one, one, two, three. 
jab, jab, cross, lead hook. That's it. Boom, boom, boom. You throw those four punches and then you stick and move. Stick and move, right? That's how it's done. Jab, jab, cross, hook. Boom, move, move, move. Good work, champ. Good work. One minute into round number two. Nice. We're about to add on. Keep it moving. Now we're going to add a lead hook to the body. So we have to level change here. Bend your knees a little bit and reach. Go. Good. So it's gonna be that left hook to the head, left hook to the body. For my lefty fighters, it's the opposite, right hook to the head or right hook to the body. Boom, perfect. Cool, let's add. We are going to add a slip and a roll. So we go for the body shot, slip to the lead, roll to the rear. When I say lead, it's the front part of the body. When I say rear, it's the back part of the body. Right, okay. So again, as a righty fighter, when I go lead, that means that's your left side, rear, that's your back side, south pause, the opposite. Cool, we're gonna add a roll with the right hook up top. So jab, jab, cross, hook, hook, slip, hook. Slip, roll, hook, that is. Boom, there we go, nice. Find your rhythm, find your pace. Remember, you set the pace, champ, you set the pace. You can go as fast or as slow as you need to. Just keep working, as long as you work harder, that's all we care about. Now we're gonna add another roll. One, one, two, three, three to the body. Slip, roll, hook, roll again. And this time your roll lands on the rear side. We're about to add one more punch and that will be your combination. Here we go, adding another rear hook, adding another four. Boom, roll, four. Nice. One, one, two, slip, roll, four, slip, yep, roll, four. There we go. I am totally fumbling on my words, but you're doing great. Let's roll and burn. Roll, hook, roll, hook, roll, hook. You got it, roll, hook, find the rotation, huh, and bang, and power, stay in those legs, power, over, boom, good again, under, go, under, go, under, go, come on, less than 10, champ, less than 10, you can do this, you got five, four, let it count down, babies, three, two, and one, going into our push-up position. Dynamic beast, hips to heels, give me the push-up. Now, check this out. Hips to heels, roll, roll, roll until you hit the plank. That's called the spinal wave. So we're alternating between the dynamic feet and the spinal wave. One involves the push-up, the other doesn't. Too much for you, regular push-up is fine. If you have to hold the plank, that's fine too. If you wanna give me kneeling push-ups, I'm good with that. This is your chance to practice and get better. I like to always, always give you something that's a little bit more progressive and advanced to give you something to work towards, but you get you can make this your own, right? You don't have to follow me exactly as long as you're in the plank position. You give me some sort of push-up or some sort of core stabilization. Great job, let's rest here. Two rounds are done. Oh my goodness, a lot more to do. But don't get discouraged, champ. We are just starting. We are just in fire mode. We can do this together. Round number three, make the cut, workout 10. Let's freaking go. Cross hook now. We're starting off the backhand, two, three, starting off round number three with two punches. Back front, two, three, cross hook. Starting off with cross hook. Boom, boom, good, rotate, rotate. Bang, bang, doing great champ. Staying nice and landing the feet as always. Don't forget to breathe. Try not to hold that breath. I see that a lot of times, especially when I work with my one-on-one -on -one clients. You know, two, three, two, we're adding on. As I finish my train of thought, we add it on across. Don't be holding your breath. Two, three, two, cross, hook, cross. Let the air come out. I see it a lot of times with my clients and my students when I'm working with them in person. They will hold their breath and we do not want that. No, no, no. Two, three, two, adding. We're adding a post. I love this move. This is where we step out and we're gonna hold that jab hand out. Two, three, two. Notice the front hand sticks out and then I step back with my back leg just a little bit. This post means that I am framing my opponent, opponent and keeping them away. Two, three, two, post babies, come on. Ish, 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 hold. Nice, we're about to add on. This is where we hold them out, we come back in, we step back in, we rotate, we add that power. Backhand, power cross, bang. So this hopefully, does the damage, but because 
we are doing stacked combination, I will add on. So of course I will add on, but if we were in the ring, man, this is deadly. This is a deadly combination, two, three, two, post two. Let's add though, let's add. We're gonna roll, we're gonna defend. So we're gonna get out. Okay, we're gonna roll underneath. We're gonna hit the two, we're gonna expect them that they hit something back, right? We avoid their punch. So we make them miss, we make them pay. Here is where we pay. This is where we owe, right? You try to throw something at me, I'm gonna throw my rear uppercut. Two, three, two, pulse, hold them out. Two, roll it underneath, give me that rear uppercut. Adding, adding a deadly lead hook. Two, three, two, pulse, two, under. Hook at the end after that rear uppercut. Boom, six, three. Find that rhythm. We're approaching the final 30 seconds of this round and you know what to do, burn it out. Six, three. This is power. Bang, bang. Love this combo. Ish, ish. Come on. Let it rip. Bang, bang. Let it rip. Let it rip. Move in between. Ish, ish. That's it. Ha, ha. Good, good, good. Keep those hands up at all times, champ. Keep those hands up. Never let that guard down. Boom, boom. Throw those two punches. Keep the hands up. Right? Keep it moving, moving, moving. Be a moving target. Almost there. Less than 10 seconds. I can't believe round three is almost over. We get to rest after this in three, two, one. We get to rest, though. Guess what? It's your full body move. Check it out. We're gonna squat, okay? Squat, leg swing, okay? Leg swing into the lunge. Squat, swing, squat, lunge. Squat, touch the toes, squat, lunge back. Same like that is lifting up, picking up to touch with your hands. You will squat back and then lunge back with the same leg, okay? Go down, squat, swing. Squat, lunge, squat, swing. Find the rhythm. This is all very rhythmic. Yup, keep it moving. Stay in those legs, stay in that lower body, creating power. Notice no jumping here, no jumping, but we're getting that heart rate to skyrocket and rest. Finally, we got to rest. Round three is done. Let me know in the comment section how you're doing. And please, 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 please do not forget to hit that thumbs up, that like button on this video. All right. Moving on, let's go. At round number four, starting off with the jab. Jab and move, jab and move, jab and move. You know the deal now, jab and move. Looking great, champ, looking great. That's it, nice work. Jab and move, jab and move. Yes, I love it, come on. Now we add the rear uppercut to the body. Jab, rear uppercut to the body. Yes, bang, level change, level change. Good, jab up. Beautiful work, jab up. Come on, babies. Uh-huh, I love it, about to add soon. Jab up, we're about to add soon. There we go. Boom, boom. Now we're adding the lead uppercut to the body. Boom, boom. Nice. Jab, two uppercuts to the body, stay low. Yep, know where you're digging, right? Know where you're digging, know where your target is. Good work, champ, come on. Jab, uppercut, uppercut. We are gonna add soon, get ready. Jab, uppercut, uppercut. Here we go. We're gonna sidestep, love this move. This is where we angle change. Check it out, we're gonna take that lead leg, right? Jab, uppercut, uppercut. Step out with the lead leg, pivot, and spin off that back leg. Take it around. Too much for you, just stay with the jab, uppercut, uppercut. Now, this is your chance to practice, right? You don't have to be perfect champ. Like, remember, this is a workout at the end of the day. If you happen to be a fighter, amateur or pro, and you're using this workout to, you know, keep yourself in shape and in check, then you give me a nice side step and then you follow it with that rear hook to the body, right? If you are advanced, I expect you to kill this move. Otherwise, if you are new to boxing and this is just for pure sweat, don't worry about it, do the best that you can. We're adding that rear hook to the body, followed by a lead uppercut up top. So we change that angle, we throw dick to the body, boom, and then we hit it right to the sideline of their jaw with that lead uppercut. I just want you to understand with that side step, you're, you're choosing an angle getting around to their side. Now from here, oh, this is a devastating overhand shot. So we're going jab, uppercut, uppercut, get around them. Hit that hook to the hollow part of their belly. 
hit their jawline with that lead uppercut, and then knock them down with that overhand shot. Final 30 seconds overhand. Notice the elbows are high. You are swinging and you are rotating that lower body in order to gain some power. Boom. Sit into that front leg, rotate. Bang. Good. Up and down, right? And when you think high to low, high to low with that overhand shot. Power back in. Come on. Everything you got, you're breathe. breathing heavy here. Breathe super heavy here. Give it all that you've got. Power, power, power. Guess what? We made it. Take it down to the ground into a push up position. All right, do your best. Military style, we are going to pulse. Three pulses. One, two, three. Push it up. Walk it out, out, in, in with the legs. Again, pulse, 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 up, out, out, in, in, alternating your lead side, right? So pulse, 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 hover the ground about three inches. Out, out, in, in, right? Left, right, left, and then the opposite. When we do it the next time around, it's gonna be left, right, left, right. Come on, 10 seconds, champ, do this. Do this to the very best that you can, and anything will do, any push-up will do, any plank will do, I'm okay with that. We've got rest now. 15 seconds to rest. We are about to hit up round number five. I can't believe four rounds are done. You are a third way into your workout. I know that sounds like a lot, but do not get discouraged. You can do this. We are in week four of Make the Cut. Here we go, starting off round number five with the jab cross. Finishing off round four, now we're in round five, babies. Here we go, jab, cross, lead rear, again. My righty fighters, left, right. My southpaw fighters, right, left. About to hit another movement here, get ready for it. So we're gonna go one, two, three. We know this combination, popular combination, basic combination, lead hook cross, effective in any fight. Right? Even if you were a beginner, right? So this is a move that you can totally master, right? Combination that you can totally master. But of course, in these workouts, we are stacking punches and moves one at a time. So right now, we're starting off with the basic jab cross hook. We're about to add on here. We're gonna go with the jab cross hook. We're gonna step it off to the side and check it. Now, in this workout, I have two types of check hooks that I've built in. This is the one of two. So you're gonna go one, two, three, step it off and then spin it out, all right? Step it off and spin it out. We step it off to the side, step it off, and then try to pivot a little bit and throw that hook at the same time, all right? One, two, three, good, you spin it out. Yeah, you just are on the balls of that front foot. Yep, you're gonna go one, two, three, jab, cross, hook, spin it out as you step it off. All right, this is just one way to check hook. All right, now we're gonna add on one, two, three, check into a rear uppercut. So you are able to gain that angle, okay, as you spin it out, and then you can throw a nice power backhand. But of course, we are adding because that's just what we do. This is a workout. So we're gonna add a jab. From here, boom, nice quick pop. Nice quick pop to that jab. One, two, three, step it off, check hook, six, one. Cool, do that again. You got time to practice, babies. Come on, let's go, champ. You can do it. One, two, three. Boom, boom, boom. And again, of course, if it messes you up or something is too much, please, 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 champ, just do the best that you can. That is all I ask of from you as your coach. Let's add one more punch. We're gonna add the two. Jab, cross, hook. Step, check, hook. Uppercut, jab, cross. Boom, boom, boom. Step it off. Bang, bang, bang. Cool. And of course, pick it up. Once you get it, you pick up that speed. Boom. All right, we're about to hit that last 30 seconds. Let's focus on that step check. Boom. Step it off, spin it. Step it off, spin it. Bang, bang. Cool, again. Pop, get them out. So you're expecting them to come at you and you are just getting out of the way and spinning it off. Boom, checking them with that hook. Yes, less than 10 seconds. In three, in two, and in one, cool body move. let's go. We are going with the forward lunge. Check it out, we're gonna step forward. Arms are gonna be in front of you over that chest. We're gonna twist over the bent knee, that's one. We're gonna go to the other side, twist, that's one. Now we're gonna add another rep. So one and two, as you iso hold that lunge. Twist one and two, nice, keep it strong. Step it through, 
one and two and three and keep adding those reps. You got it, one and two and three and we're gonna keep adding every single time. So what we do on the right is what we're gonna do on the left. So now I'm at, now I'm at four reps on the right, then we're gonna go four reps on the left. You keep going until time is up, which is up very soon in three and two and ding, 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 rest it up here. Leave me a comment, champ. Are you sharing this workout with others? Don't forget to share this on your other social platforms, right? I love when we interact together. Place a comment down below. Let me know how you're doing. Round number six, here we go. Starting off the jab. We're jabbing again. I want you to stay in those legs. Jab and move, stick it and move. There you go, champ. Doing great. Jab and move, jab and move. Now we're adding. Here we go, double jab. Adding the double jab. Jab, jab, there you go. Come on, one, one and move, one, one and move. Ish, ish. That's it. Ish, ish. Beautiful work there. Nice. Uh -uh. Now we have the cross. Jab, jab, cross. Yep, jab, jab, cross. That's it. There you go. One, one, two. Nice and quick. We've done this before. In fact, we've had started a round. I don't know if you recall. We started a round with the one, one, two, right? One, one, two. Okay. Adding. We're gonna slip it. One, two, three. We slip three times, I want you to move it up. One, one, two, slip, slip, slip. Cool. One, one, two, slip, slip, slip. A little Mike Tyson-ish here, moving up. Good. Not exactly the peekaboo, but it has that feel. Boom, 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 right? Moving forward with the slips. It was a little bit off to the side. Good again. Boom, boom, bang. Uh, uh, uh. That's it. Looking good. Looking good. I want you to check it out here very soon. One, one, two. Slip, slip, slip. All right. Pay attention. So now we're going to shift with the back leg. One, one, two. Slip off to the side. Then we're going to turn like as if we're on our skateboard. And what we do is we load in that back leg and we shift and distribute the weight and both feet have to move on. Okay, so one, one, two, slip, 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 shift. I want you to try to shift like you're on a skateboard. Too much for you, eliminate the shift, okay? That's okay. All right, cool. Now, we add on. One, one, two, slip, 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 shift, five. Too much, you can always give me the one, one, two, slip, slip, five, instead of adding the shift. All right, it's okay. You're not in trouble if you don't do it perfectly. I promise you, I won't get mad. You're doing awesome, champ. Let's go, one, one, two, slip, 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 shift, lead, uppercut, perfect. Now, slip into those shifts. Slip three times, shift into the lead, uppercut. Good, 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 keep working, keep working. You're doing great. This is, again, your opportunity to practice, 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 right? It doesn't have to be perfect. Do your very best. Less than 10 seconds now. Round six is almost done. We're about to move on to round seven, but you know that after this round, we've got a 45-second full body interval in three, two, and one. Very nice. All right, taking it back down to the ground, okay? We're going kick through. Check this out. Taking my right leg. I'm going to kick through. From here, that right leg comes up. I go into a beast push-up. Then I'm gonna switch, kick through left. Kick that left leg up like you're in a donkey kick and give me that one-legged pu uh, beast push-up. Super challenging, like super challenging. This is definitely hardcore, this is definitely advanced, but you are going to try any variation of this that you want, regular push-ups, could be the beast, it could be just the kick through, like make this your own, okay? I want you to make this your own. This is your workout at the end of the day. I am proud of you, I really am. This, so yes, no jumping, right? But I'm trying to motivate you, inspire you to do something different, unique with your body, something that will strengthen you and push you to the next level. Round number seven, jab, duck, cross. I want you to level sit, sit like change your levels on this, I right, sit into your seat and then you come back up with the right hand. Left if you're a south block. So jab, duck, come back up top with the cross. 
boom, boom, boom. Nice, just level change. It's just dropping, dropping a little bit of a level, right? You're evading a punch possibly, or you're making your opponent guess, right? They don't see when you're jumping like that. They won't see that backhand coming up after, right? They won't see it, boom. Always keep your opponent guessing. And if this is just a fitness workout, right? If this is just, okay, I'm doing this to work out. Guess what, it's a mini squat with those legs. How about that? Now we're gonna go with five, six, five, six, moving backwards. One, up, two, up, 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 as you are moving backwards, adding the footwork. Yup, really important to keep the spacing between your front leg and the back leg, right? When you step back, right? We don't want the feet to cross at any point because we don't want to lose the balance. So we always keep the separation of the legs, right? Boom, 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 up, 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 as you move backwards. And it's, these are quick. These are quick. One, duck, two, up, 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 move back quickly. Little teeny tiny movement, little steps backwards. Awesome job, champ. Come on, boom, 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 boom. All right, now, remember I talked about the second check? It's right here. Slow motion here. Take this front back, front leg to back. Notice the front leg again, right? You wanna spin and rotate the upper body as you step back. So step back with that front leg and change your angle. I know this is a tough move. Boom. And as you do that, you are gonna throw the hook at the same time. Now, too much, forget the check and just give me a regular hook. Like, this is a super advanced move. This is where you, the opponent is attacking you and you've, you're going backwards and changing the angle on them and checking them, okay? Checking them with the hook, right? Just kind of catching them off guard, slapping them around a little bit. And like I said, too much for you, eliminate that footwork move, that check move, that angle move, right? And just throw the regular hook. But guess what? The final 30 seconds is for you to practice. Step back with the front leg. Good. Change this perspective. Bang. Do it again. Practice, practice. Good work. Again, I always like to dedicate the final last 30 seconds to some sort of drill or move something that'll get your heart rate up or a technique that we want to improve upon. So this is your chance. This is your chance, champ. In three, two, one. All right, forget about the check now. We are going into abs, legs straight in front, arms behind. Come up to your seat, lift the leg, one. Come back, back, back. come back up, one and two. Lift those legs, make sure those legs tap. Forward, arms are in front of those hips and focus on lifting where your lower abdominals are working here, okay? Doing so freaking good there, champ. Back and up and lift and lift and lift and lift. Keep adding a repetition every single time. Let it burn. Not sure what number we're up to, but we are gonna continue to work until the time is up. And it's up right now. Rest here, well-deserved champ. Let me know in the comment section how you are doing. Don't forget to like this video and share this on your platforms and share this video with your friends. Don't forget to subscribe. Did I miss anything? All right, so moving to round number eight. One, six, jab, rear uppercut. Jab, rear uppercut, doing fantastic. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Bang, bang. Nice, nice, nice. Do it again. Ish, ish. Good, jab, uppercut. Pop, pop, everything's up top now. Everything is up top. Let's get it, let's get it, let's get it. Come on, keep moving. Jab up. Yes, 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 jab uppercut. We are adding a roll. As you roll, I want you to step it out with that back foot. Again, changing the angle. One, six, angle it out. Under and out, under and out. That's what I want you to think. Sometimes we leave and we are in our spot. In this case, we are not leaving, we are rolling it out. We are using our footwork to gain a different angle. Good. From here, we are about to counter. Get ready for it. Jab, uppercut, roll it out, and then we add a frame. So, jab, uppercut, roll it out, and we're gonna frame. Watch. Jab, up, roll, and frame with that lead hand to their body. So, as we gain their angle, right, we're over to the side of their body, and we're gonna keep them out. We're gonna control them. 
Okay, we're gonna control them. So this little rolling out, we're gonna control them, then we hit a body shot with our rear hand. Okay, so we're using the front hand to control them, and then we are gonna give them a nice devastating body shot. Are we getting it so far, champ? I hope so. I hope that these workout videos are different than what you see from other boxing channels out there. I try to give you something a little bit more advanced, something that you can work on. And I know it can maybe be a lot if you are a beginner, but you could totally do this. Now I'm adding another thing. I'm gonna step out and I'm gonna frame again with the post. We did the post before in the earlier round. Boom, bang. So we wanna kinda step out and throw that as a jab hand holding them out. Now I'm going jab, cross, jab, cross, okay? I know, it's a lot, you could do it though. Jab, up, roll, frame, uppercut to the body, post, two, one, two, cross, jab, cross. Hold, out, boom, boom, boom. Cool, I know, it's a really long combination, and as I was saying before, if you're a beginner, I just ask that you do the very best that you can. I want this to be an all-level workout, right? So you do the best that you can. That's all I can ask of you to do. That's all you can do. Last 30, post two, one, two. Hold, two, one, two. Hold, two, one, two. Nice and quick. Hold, notice I get in, I get in. Good. Again, two, one, two. Hold, two, one, two. 10 seconds left, champ. Yes, nice work. Two, one, two. We're almost there, champ, we're almost there. All right, lower body here. We're gonna curtsy. So a curtsy, we're gonna squat, lift your heels. Other side, curtsy, squat, lift the heels, get onto the toes. Again, alternating sides. Boom, good, again. Over, center, lift, lift. Good, again. Uh-huh, find the rhythm. Nice. Nice, do it again. Good work, champ, good work. Boom, bang, uh-huh, nice. Very, very good rest here, so good, so good. Amazing, that's all I can say. Let me know in the comments. Again, I'm always gonna continue to remind you, round nine on deck, you ready? All right, starting off with a lead hook into a rear uppercut, three, six. Three, six, nice, that's it. Rotate, rotate, this is a lot of rotation here. Three, six, boom, boom. Good work, champ, ish, ish. Back to stack on, three, six, three, nice. Good work, champ, good work. Three, six, three, we are so close, round nine. Oh, we have a total of 12. We're making it this far. This is gonna go by in a flash. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention, the bonus is always at the end if you're new to my channel. Bonuses, I add a little extra spice to our workout. It gets a little saucy at the end. I just wanna make sure you're working hard. Three, six, three. I'm sorry, but like not sorry, you know what I mean? All right, now we're gonna roll to the lead side. We're gonna stay in our spot, but we're gonna leave it to the lead side. Three, six, three, weave under, okay? Three, six, three, weave. Three, six, three, weave. Or roll, just, or duck, it doesn't matter what you call it, just get under it. Now, this is the bottom weave. This is where we're gonna go under, under twice, right? Three, six, three, under, under twice. Boom, 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 under, under. Staying, keeping our feet where they are. Staying in our spot. Ish, 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 under, under. Yep, staying right there in the pocket, yep. Again, three, six, three, under, under. Doing great, champ. Let's add on here. Rear hook to the body. Staying low. Three, six, three, under, under, stay low, boom. Nice. Yep, 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 doing great, champ. Come on, you can do it. Again, again. Now adding a rear and a lead hook to the body. So it's not just the rear hook anymore. Now it's the lead hook to the body. Boom, boom. Hook up, hook. Bob we. Hook body, hook body. Guess what? Adding a rear hook up top. Yes, add the rear hook up top now. Nice. 
guess what? Add a lead hook up top. You travel those hooks up the body now. Body, body, head, head. Boom, boom, boom. Body, body, head, head. Beautiful work, Cam. Beautiful work. Bang, 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 bang. Nice. Boom, boom. Under, under, under. Boom. That's it. Now body shots. Your chance to kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it. Your chance to kill it. Come on, champ. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Boom, 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 boom. Stay in those legs, stay in those legs. I want you to huff and puff and sweat and burn. Sweat it out and burn. Feel those muscles in your body. Come on, I want you to work really, really hard here. Let's amp it up. Time to work, champ. Hustle mode, hustle mode in three, in two. Guess what? And rest. I love this move. You're gonna come up onto your back. Legs are a little bit wider than hip wide apart. This is called the starfish. Come up, crab reach. Starfish sit up. Get into your heels. Lift those hips up from the ground. Get one arm to reach towards the opposite wrist. Getting a back extension. Getting a hip opening. Pushing through the heels. Getting your glutes to work. Yes, up and over. Sit up, starfish. Grab reach right here. You've got 10 more seconds to go. Reach up and over. Reach, reach, reach. Pushing through those heels. Get those hips as high as you can. Squeeze those glutes as much as you can. In three, two, guess what? You rest for 15 seconds. This is well-deserved. Champ, in my brain, I know we've got round 10, 11, 12, followed by your bonus. About 15 more minutes worth of work. You can do this. Are you ready? Next round, here we go. Getting into the one one. That's your double jab with your lead hands. Round number 10, starting off with one one. And I want you to think about really grounding your legs and then stepping forward as you hit that jab jab, right? So you wanna stay in those legs, step it off, one one. Good, turn those hands up and over. Always be moving in between your uh, combination here, right? Keep breathing, right? Make these jabs snappy. And then we're adding the one, one, two. Jab, jab, cross. You know this combination, right? Jab, jab, cross. Good, good, good. Now for the sake of the workouts, like I mentioned before, we're just adding and stacking one punch or one defensive move at a time. But in the ring, like this would be it, right? One, one, two. Now we're gonna step it off and you're gonna give me the, the little Cuban step with the jab. So it's a step jab. There we go. So we're going jab, jab, cross, step jab. So what we're doing is getting our head off the midline as we step the back foot out a little bit on this angle. Bang, bang, boom, step it out and throw the jab at the same time, keep that jab up and high and then we're gonna step back in and add a cross. Here we go. One, one, two, step one, two. Jab, jab, cross, step it out, jab, cross. Good, as you step out, you throw the jab. You step in, you throw the cross. Yes, let's go, let's go, let's get it, champ, let's get it. Come on, one, one, two, step, one, two. Yup, that's how it's done. And remember, you don't have to be perfect. This is a workout at the end of the day. You do your very best. Let's add on here. We're gonna add a duck, another defensive move. So after you throw that cross, you're just gonna level change and sit into your seat, right? Sometimes I call this the boxer squat, yeah. So you're just gonna sit into that seat. There we go, nice little level change, a little duck. Evade, get out of the way, don't get hit. What do we say here, champ? Make them miss and then make them pay. So here we go, we are making them pay by adding the two. One, one, two, step one, two, duck two. All straight punches in this combination. Boom, boom, boom. Yes. All right, we're gonna add on. Are you ready for it? Here we go, we're gonna add on a body shot. Right after that, duck two, baby. You go for the body, you can either give me a shovel hook, right? or an uppercut, or a hook there. All right, now we're gonna add on the cross up top. Boom, bang, perfect. So you get that angle on the body shot. Hit them right back up top, upstairs, awesome. All right, your final 30 seconds is here. We're gonna duck two into body two. Duck two, body two. Boom, bang, bang, good. Again, hit them right into the body. That's it, sit into the seat with that duck. Give me that cross, body, cross. Nice, again, huh. bang, bang, bang. Good, again, come on, 10 more seconds, champ. Ten. Round 10 is almost done, babies, let's go. Come on, come on, come on. Round 10, workout 10 of Make the Cut. Our full body interval is about to happen right now. We're gonna go ahead with lower body here instead of full body. I don't know why I said that, but 
all of this is really full body with all these intervals, right? We're trying to hit it from head to toe. We are going into a lateral lunge, into a one-legged DL. This has to be all about balance and stability. So I want you to make sure that you sit into the seat. You're gonna kick that same leg back, touch the ground, and then switch sides. Side lunge here, same leg that side lunges. You try to balance, you kick it back, you stay grounded on that standing leg. 10 seconds, you make this your own, do what you gotta do. Notice that yes, this is lower body, but this is all about core stability. Core, core, core. Tuck it in in three, two, one. Beautiful, rest here. All right, if my counting is correct, 11 and 12 are up next. You are doing great, 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 and I am so, so proud of you for making it this far. All right, let's go ahead, round 11, starting off with a double jab again, just like we did in that last round. Double jab again, we love our jabs. Good, 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 keep moving, keep moving. Boom, boom, nice long punches. That's it, long punches, hit that jab, double, double. Pa, pa. Now we're going with the cross to the body. One, one, two to the body. Good, again with the level changes, right? Bang, bang, show me the difference. Show me the difference of, of targeting either the nose, the mouth, the forehead, or something up top versus maybe a chest shot, a solar plexus shot, right? Like, show me the difference in your level changes, right? You have to. I want this to be straight punches. One, one, and two to the body, add it. We're going back with the one, two up top. A total of five punches, back to those straight punches. One, one, two, one, two. Yeah, doing great. How you feeling? Hopefully you're confident by round number 11, right? One, one, two to the body, one, two upstairs, jab, cross. Now we're adding the lead hook right after. Double jab, cross to the body. Jab, cross, lead hook up top. There you go. Double jab up top, cross to the body, one, two, three. Rotate, rotate, right? Change up your angles, right? Throw that hook, move in between. You can give me a slip, you can give me a roll, and guess what? That's what we're doing right here. You're gonna slip and roll. As we slip to the lead side, we're gonna roll towards the rear, setting ourselves up for the next move. One, one, two to the body, one, two, three, slip and roll into another slip. Yup. Cool, so as you roll to the right, now I want you to slip back to the left, my orthodox fighters. For my southpaw, as you roll to the left, you're gonna slip back to your right. Now we add the body shot, lead hand. One, one, two, one, two, three. Slip, roll, slip, body. Cool, got it? Nice. Let's keep it moving. Let's keep it moving. Come on champ, you can do it, let's add on. Oh, the devastating overhand shot right here. Body, boom, up and over. I want you to go ahead, make sure that you have that nice weight distribution in your legs. Right, you shift, boom, bang. As soon as you hit that overhand shot with that, I'm sorry, that lead body shot, right? You should be shifted into that front leg. And so, so you're winding up into that front leg with that backhand, if that makes sense. Now let's go ahead and drill it. Roll, slip, body shot over. Look at the weight distribution. Roll, slip, body weight over. So when you hit that overhand shot, you should be nice into those legs, right? Rotate that body. Boom, 80% of that weight into that front leg with that overhand shot. Bang, bang, beautiful. Now, guess what? We're gonna rest. We're gonna go into the ground. Resting from the punching, moving into our core. Rock to sit and twist. Come onto the shoulder blades, go ahead onto the sit bone, twist. Now, we twisted right, we twisted left. Now you're gonna give me two on each. So you rock to sit in the middle. Two twists, stick the landing, two twists on the other side. And you guessed it, you're gonna count three now. One, two, three, rock to sit. And stick it, stick it, stick it. Less than 10, champ, you can do this. Come on, champ, come on, give me those obliques, give me those obliques. Yup, tight core in three, two, one, fully on rest. Take a full deep breath in, woo -wee! Jam, come on, did you smash that thumbs up button yet? What are you waiting for? What are you waiting for? Okay, all right, we'll wait till the end of the workout. But let's go ahead, moving into 
to round number one. With the, uh, round number one, what am I saying? Round number 12 with the one, with the jab. One, there you go. Round number 12 with the one. Throw that jab hand, now we're gonna block with the rear. I want you to picture that your opponent is throwing either the jab or the left hook at you. Yep, boom, block. Now we're gonna block with the other hand. So you're gonna turn, roll. you've heard of the rolling with the punches, right? You've heard that turn, that's what you're doing. You're blocking, I want you to rotate a little bit on those blocks. There we go, keeping the elbows in. We're not flaring those elbows out. Especially on the block, keep it tight, tight guard. Tight, tight, tight guard. Yup, 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 nice. Keep it moving, keep it moving, there we go. Now we add a roll. Block, block, underneath towards the lead side. Block lead. Into a roll on the lead side. Jab, block, rear, block, lead, roll. Good, again. Jab, block, block, roll. Yup, very nice. Move in between, stay nice and light in the feet. Keep breathing. Now we add, we're gonna add a three. Boom, let's add that lead hook for power. You're set up for that shot. Yep, bang. You go underneath the lead, you're set up for that counter lead hand. One, block, block, roll, three. Nice. We're gonna slip and roll now. Slip, roll, get back to the rear. Lots of defense in this combination. Three, slip, roll, slip, lead, roll, rear. You guessed it, adding a rear hook. Add four. One, block, block, roll. Three, slip, roll, four. Nice. Let's go. We're almost there, champ, we're almost there. Boom, slip, roll, four. Oh, now we're adding four uppercuts. Four, five, six, five, six. Adding those four uppercuts. Again, again, come on. Ha, 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 let's pick up the uppercuts now. Pick it up. We add two hooks. So roll four, up, 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 hook, hook. So these uppercuts turn to a shoe shine. Follow it up with two more hooks to finish. Bang, bang. One, block, block, roll three, slip, roll four, shoe shine, three, four. This is just bang, bang. Guess what we drill, final 30 seconds. Give me that shoe shine. Hook, hook. Give me that shoe shine. Hook, hook, move in between. Ba, 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 bang, bang. Ish, 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 bang, bang. Four uppercuts, boom, boom, flurry those hands, come on. Let's go, let's go, come on champ, this is it. Round 12 is almost done. We've got another exercise for our body, then we've got that bonus. We are so close to being done champ. I need you to finish this workout ten of Make the Cut Strong. Come on, you've got less than five seconds, baby. Five seconds, you can do it. Find that hustle, find that hustle. Yes, now take it down to the ground. We are working our core. Get to your elbows, little plank position. Oh, this is gonna be a crazy one. Inchworm those legs out. Get the belly to touch the ground. Inchworm those legs in. Get the shoulders to touch the thumbs. Let the belly hit the ground. So this is a little inchworm. Slowly crawl. Slowly crawl like a worm would crawl. Yes. Keep your core tucked in. If it's too much for you, just hold that low plank. You have my permission. You don't need my permission. You do what you need to do, but make this challenging, right? This is an advanced move for sure. I won't sugarcoat this one. This is insane. This is an insane exercise. You got it in three, two, one. Rest. Woo! All right. Just a few more moments. I do want to take this moment to congratulate you for completing 12 rounds, but I will say this. I still need you to hustle, champ. I need you to do the work. We've got a couple more minutes left. A little extra sauce. Here we go. Jab, jab, let's go. Jab and move, jab and move, jab and move. Let's go, jab and move, jab and move. Now, jab, cross and move. All right, jab, cross and move. Give me a little bit more hustle. Pick up that like pace a little. Now you know your punches, right? I know you know your punches. We've done all these long combinations. Add the lead hook. One, two, three. Jab, cross, hook now. Jab, cross, hook. We're gonna keep adding. Jab, cross, hook, hook. One, two, three, four. Four punches. One, two, three, four. There we go, champ. Come on. We're about to add on again. One, two, three, four. Guess what? I'm sure you know. We're gonna add that five. One, two, three, four, five. Let's go with all those six punches, right? One, two, three, four, five right here. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five. Ish, 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 ish. Come on. Now, guess what? Add the six. Give me all six punches, champs. All six punches. Now, one, two, three, four, five, six. In that order. Give me six punches and move. Come on. I want you to pick up that pace now. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. Start to sweat. Sweat, sweat real good. Tuck that chin down. Keep moving in between. Get your head off the midline. Move, move, move. Last 
last one right here and nice all right now non-stop one two three four five six one two three four five six plant your feet non-stop boom boom bang 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 boom boom bang 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 come on yes let's go we're not stopping we're not stopping stay with me stay with me come on you can do this now bob and weave keep your feet planted just bob and weave roll under roll under roll under come on uh 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 yes yes all right slip it left to right right to left let's go slip get your head off the midline duck duck sit into the seat all defenses all defense pull 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 good just shift back now bob weave slip slip duck pull put it all together under under slip slip duck pull again under under slip slip duck pull again practice all head movement all head movement nice all right now i want you to freestyle your defense just keep moving your head off the midline keep your feet planted yep 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 yeah you can step back a little bit if you want give me some cuban step block roll do what you got to do ones and twos not stop now ones and twos not stop come on you can do it you can do it you saw how I gave, I gave you that nod i know you can do it now hook hook you can do this too you can do anything champ anything and everything body shots let's go that's what i love about boxing it's a metaphor for life baby let's go shoe shine Quick, 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 quick. Yes. Up, 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 up. Fast, 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 fast. Fast, 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 fast. Nice. Come on. Take it down to plank, high plank, right here. Hold. Hold, hold, hold. Don't move. Pull everything in. Pull everything in. You have about a minute left with me. Low plank position right here. Low, low, low. Yup. Come on. Low plank side, choose a side, any side. Low plank side, choose a side, any side. Peel that bottom hip off the ground. Keep it tight, keep it right. Roll through the center, get the other side now. Get that other side now. Yep, doesn't matter which side you started with. Get to the opposite, pull that bottom hip up. Now go back to the center. High plank position. Hold, hold, hold. Keep it tight, keep it tight, keep it tight. Now. Cover the ground, a couple inches off the ground. Bottom hold into the push-up. Yup, there's space between the chest and the ground. Now press up and hold that plank. One more time, guess what champ, you got three. You got two, you got one. And done. And all I gotta say is, wow, we are done. We did it together. 10 is done, workout 11 on deck. Make the cut, baby. You did it, I'm proud of you. Till next time.